Another Indonesian volcano is showing signs of restlessness. Saputan, a stratovolcano in Indonesia, is showing signs of restlessness, according to volcanologists in the region. This volcano also happens to be on Sulawesi, the island that was just subjected to a horrific earthquake and tsunami. Let me be absolutely clear before we dive into the details here. There's no way of saying whether this volcano will erupt, or when. It's simply showing signs of increased activity beneath the surface, is one of the island's most active volcanoes. According to a 2012 review of the volcano, it's quite complex. Although it features basaltic lava, something typified by a shield volcano like Hawaii's Kiloi, its strange plumbing system means that it can also produce explosive eruptions. There are historical records of eruptions of varying types going back to 1450 CE, including effusive lava flows and high altitude ash plumes to pyroclastic flows though superheated, fast. Moving clouds of gas and ash that most recent killed dozens of people on the flanks of Guatemala's Vulcan de Fuego. These can form when the ash column loses buoyancy and collapses, or when a thick lava dome growth bursts and spills over the crater rim. There's also a risk of lahas, mudflows made of volcanic debris, that form when rain saturates the volcanic ash after it's been deposited. Saputin is a bit of a pyrotechnical artist capable of many things, all of which can be deadly and enough people are in the way. It also means that it's somewhat unpredictable. Thermal cameras are showing that the top of the volcano is hotter than it was a few weeks back, suggesting a high temperature magma is pooling there. Although no ash plumes have been observed, it appears that far more volcanic gas is escaping at the summer today compared to a month ago. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube. If you like donate to us visit home on the page PayPal.